it's here. The Ice Cream 4 trailer is here. We've been waiting so long for this thing and it looks so beautiful. Look at this. I am so excited. Let's break this thing down. What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Zach Blake here. Um, trailer is loaded up. I am going to break it down after, but let's watch it together once. Um, this has been like a year in the making, so um, I I'm already I already have goosebumps already. You know, it's like preemptive goosebumps. All right, so this is the trailer. Oh yeah, let's watch this. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can notice anything the first time. Ooh, what's going on? Oh wow. This is how it's starting up. He's driving right on into his factory. It looks really good. Ooh, I already noticed some stuff. All right, all right, intense. We got that moving, like giant statue of him. Oh wait, wait, that's the garage that we saw in like the um, the photos in the other news video. Whoa, okay, so that's what that was. Jeez. Dude, it's got a fancy elevator in there. Oh, wait! There's us! He's bringing us in! Oh, okay! Oh, Rod is such like, a creepy character, I love it. I love how we're just looking around, though. Oh, there's everybody! <laughs> oh my gosh! We're gonna make some ice cream fun! <laughs> gosh. Well, 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 kids, you're all reunited again? <laughs> yes, okay. I'll leave you alone a moment so you can talk about your adventures. <laughs> oh, wow. So creepy. But don't get too comfortable. No, no, no. Now that you're all beautiful and plump and chubby, soon you will enter my special room and I'll squeeze you to the last drop. Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> that is so cool! Oh wow. Okay. There's so much to break down. First off, I have to say, uh, the voice actor for Rod is so good. He makes it so creepy because easily they could have made a character that was like, I am going to destroy you. <laughs> you will be ice cream. No, he's like, <laughs> I will get every last drop out of you. It's like somehow he brings to the character something like so creepy and like, like chaotic and psychotic almost. But First on the agenda, look at this factory. It looks so good. And so this is what it's gonna look like in game. And if time serves right, every single trailer that we've gotten has been like the intro to the actual game. So what I'm thinking is that this is actual gameplay, right? Um, we In our last news video, we changed this to say beans so that it's literally just Rod's dad and he's just looking at you with a, he's holding an ice cream cone. He's just like, Beans! <laughs> but um, from what I see though, when I said I noticed something, if we go just a little bit forward, it like pans up. You could see the entirety of his factory here. And then look, you could see four rooms that are what looks like the purple room. I'm just gonna call it the purple room. And so what the purple room probably means to me is these are like the rooms where he turns children into ice cream. That's what he said, right? Like he said, I'll squeeze out Every last drop. I have no idea what that's supposed to mean. It's kind of gross, but okay, man. So maybe um, when we go through the doors, that's when we walk through here. We went through his little, like, this is like, right here would be like the little uh, zone we were held in and all of our friends were held in when we're captured. And then these rooms are gonna be the mystery rooms that we probably have to like solve to, I guess, dismantle? I don't know. Yo, and what is up with this giant ice cream statue? It is intense. Look at this. Oh, and so when I was talking about before, this garage was, um, I guess, hinted in little uh, sneak peeks that we were looking at before. And it looks like it got like super developed. Yo, also, 
What if there's like secrets in this video that we haven't noticed? Tell me if you see anything, but I see like a little light post over here and it is very bright off in the corner. I hope that they add some really cool Easter egg like they did in the last game with the golden fish. That thing took so long to get and it was so fun. So I wanna see if maybe they do some sort of Easter egg. I'm looking. I'm looking! You see, as for us, when we're going through, I, I, the thing I noticed first off is that we're sitting in here. Jay is so cool. Like, he, he purposefully got himself captured so that he could enter this facility. You think how, like, cool that is? To be like, yeah, I'm gonna put myself into danger to save my friends. Like, that is... He's a true hero. I think you could even notice that he's like truly really cool because he's sitting in his cage and he's literally just like, this is no big deal. This is no big deal. Yeah, look, he's just like, he just looks like he doesn't care. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, wait, wait, but let's see if we can see any secrets. So this is the outside there. Um, this is the door that he turns into. Okay, I'm gonna try to figure this out. So when we start this game, we get to know it, you know? Okay, so this is called the waiting room. I just saw it right now. He's bringing us into the waiting room, and I'm guessing that's where all the kids go. Oh, gosh. Okay, and I've noticed that... Okay, so what do these mean? What do these lights mean? You would think that they have some sort of, like, meaning to them. Like, oh, maybe these three are, like, lit up because he's got, like, all of our friends and these ones. But, like, some of these things are just lit up for no reason. I guess we'll have to figure that one out. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so we got Mike right here. He looks... Oh, Liz looks so calm. <laughs> Liz looks like she doesn't care. Looks, Liz looks like she's just sitting there like, Jay, hurry up. Jay! <laughs> Come on. Ice cream. Oh man. Okay, but Charlie's like, come on, dude. Come on, hurry up. But seriously, listen to the voice actor of Rod. He oh sounds so. Ice cream he sounds so creepy. <laughs> Do you hear this? It, it's so good because he gives like this creepy, almost like Pennywise, like a clown, like scariness to him. I love it. I just love how his character is like. He has, it has everything and it, it's really crazy to hear it, but you could hear just like the suffering in his like backstory because he's like, he's I want to be cheery, but I can't control my anger. Like that's what it sounds like. Reunited again? Oh no, like just listen. I'll leave you alone a moment so you can talk about your adventures. <laughs> oh gosh, it's so creepy. But don't get too comfortable, no, no, no. Now that you're all beautiful and plump and chubby, soon you will enter my special room and I'll squeeze you to the last drop. <laughs> that right there is so good. It's so good. Now, I noticed something as I was watching again. There's something right here and I don't know what it is. It could just be nothing, but I see something that says like on on it or something. Like, this is going to be something. And I'm thinking how it's gonna go is he says like, you guys can get acquainted. He's getting everything ready to basically turn us into ice cream. And we're probably sitting there and we're probably gonna figure out some way. Now, if we got ourselves into this situation, right? Where um, we got caught on purpose, maybe we are sneaking in something. Like we snuck in a screwdriver. We are prepared. We're doing a breakout mission. These people are captured. Our friends are captured and we're gonna save him. Now, I don't know if this has any warrant to be talked about because I have no idea what this is going to be, but it talks about like squeezing the kids. I remember I was like, I was always wondering like, how is he turning kids into ice cream? I have no idea, but it seems like he, he's talking about it a lot in this trailer of like squeezing them. Like we're going to squeeze some kids today. And then the other one, he's like, I'm gonna squeeze every last drop out of you. I don't know per se what this whole thing is about. It's also kind of magical because the ice cream is supposed to like instantly turn you like super chubby. So like, I don't, I don't know the magic behind this thing. Like, how are we gonna stop this? And again, like I've talked about in our other news videos, I feel like this one is gonna be the one that people watch the most because it's about to come out. Like it is about to come out. This is the trailer. And I think that my theories are probably gonna be right. Do you see these tubes over here? There's a red tube, a blue tube, a yellow tube, and a purple tube. And I think 
that this is gonna be something like very important. So, this is my theory of how it's gonna start. We basically get the little intro here. It goes all the way through. We see our friends. He goes, ha ha ha, my evil plan. You know like villains do? They're like, this is my plan. Now here is some time for you to stop me. I'm going to be in this room. I can't hear you, la la la. Don't stop me. He's basically, he's, he's setting up, you know, in, in most stories like the opportunity to break out. Now, if you wanted to be like really good about it, technically Rod could just bring us in the room. Like, I'm gonna get the machine ready while I watch you. You're not getting out of my sight. But he's like, I like the fact that you guys are wriggling in fear. And then we're gonna find a way maybe, oh, you know that, that thing over here, this little can, maybe it's like some, I don't know, cage melting thing. Ah, that seems kind of far-fetched. I think basically we're breaking out of the cage one way or another. We break out and then we have to find like three keys or something. Three keys to break out our friends. So we're gonna start running, and then that's when Rod's gonna walk through the room and be like, wait, where is he? Where is that one? Like he's gonna start freaking out. I think that that's gonna be intense. So then he'll start chasing me around. He'll probably send his little goons after me because we know that there's like little tiny versions of him. Like, like his little kids, his little robot kids. He's gonna send them after me. Um, I hope that I can befriend them. Some we'll, we'll mess around in the game, right? We're gonna try to figure it out, solve some puzzles, come back with the keys, unlock it, and then try to escape. Now we know this is not going to be the last game, so I'm sure there's gonna be something that he does, but we're in the heat of it. We're in the heart of his factory. Like, I don't know how much more dangerous we can get. We're literally right next to the machine that's gonna kill us, so. I don't know, this is gonna be very intense. I mean, just the pure maniacalness of him just laughing and saying he's gonna squeeze the last drop out of us. It's, I am so hyped, it's getting me so hyped. Like, this is coming out soon and it's gonna be a new era because it's been a year since Ice Cream 3 and that feels so long ago, doesn't it? And the cool thing is, is that we saw this in the last episode, right? Uh, this whole little souvenir shop. I wonder if there's going to be multiple locations or if it's just a giant factory, right? Like, oh, there's different parts of the factory we go around. Because in the last games, we literally got in his truck and drove to other locations, so... I mean, I hope that there's other locations, but if this thing is so big that we don't even need to travel anywhere, that would be intense. But we know that this is going to have a little mini game. Um, I hope that there's gonna be Easter eggs. I hope that we can find some things like, like look at that, there's a little tiny cutout of Rod. What if we can carry that and just distract him? Like, hey, look, we're, we're you, don't eat us. Please? But yeah, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. I want to hear your guys' theories. Like, I want to read, like, basically paint the picture of me in your comment below, right? Like, like, like you, uh, it starts out with you driving into the factory. Uh, Rod pulls you up and brings your cage up to your friends. You know, like, tell me the story because, you know, these might also play a little difference in here. There's three lights that we saw and especially in the little trailer that are like lit up and I wonder if you have to go throughout the factory and like activate all of the switches so that they're all green and then everything opens up maybe maybe there's a security room I don't know I want to I want to read all your guys' theories so that when the game comes out I'll be like dude there was a comment that predicted the whole thing you know I feel like that would be fun but are you guys hyped like seriously I am so hyped I'm so excited for this thing I've been making news videos and I've been like hopefully it's coming out soon and at the end of uh the trailer it said spring aren't we in spring now right we just had spring break or this is this is like spring break so like is it is it like this week next week when is it coming out but yeah this is going to be a super fun game and the fact that it's been so long in the making i think that there's going to be so much like between ice cream one to ice cream two there was such a big difference two to three intense difference like so big difference and now three to four Probably going to be the biggest game so far. I hope at least um, but I'm excited um, Hopefully you've enjoyed the breaking down of this. I know we've discovered it's very like very small things, right? I think they've kind of compacted everything down just so that you're surprised when the game comes out So tell me what you guys think. Tell me your guys theories. I'll see you in the next video We're doing a lot of crazy stuff this week. I'll see you there. Thank you guys for watching and as always Peace out my dudes